the same way for yeah. And a good burn on the Palo Santo. Try not to burn down the domicile. Flame me out. <coughs> what? Okay then. Ah. Uh -huh. Namaste, my Phoenicians. Let me clear up all of this negative energy. Welcome or welcome back to Frequency Phoenix 555 for your daily message or massages. Mm -hmm. Let's put it to one side. Today, my Phoenicians, Maybe a little triggering for some and others. We have to have this hard talk sometimes. Because you've got to keep it real with yourself. Some of my Phoenicians are struggling with the move on, the letting go. Yes, yes, yes. You can say you've let go all you want, right? But you can't hide the truth from spirit. So therefore, I have been elected to point it out. Because you know that I'm a pointer, not a picker. As I sip my mocha. We're going to be talking about the, calm, the what ifs of the karmic partner. First, we're going to have a look at my... Um, my astrology notes for today. Today is going to provide a lot of cosmic guidance for all areas of your spiritual development. Mm -hmm. Listening to your inner soul is where you find the most solace these days. The waxing givenness. Sorry, the waxing. Listen, Mercury retrograde. The waxing gibbous moon is gentle. Pisces continues to propel you through the channels of your most profound inner work. Mm -hmm. Use the energy of this retrograde to reflect and renew. Mm -hmm. Many might have gone completely silent. This is because of all of the transits. Mm -hmm. A lot of ghosting has been happening for a lot of people. That have put themselves in the arena. With the dick dealers, the mattress. Listen, don't get me on my Tourette's. As I put on my mic so you can feel me. The Bluetooth device is really too pale. Mm -hmm. Some of you may even find that they are... Some of you may even find that it's extremely difficult to focus on mundane tasks at the moment. Especially if somebody's um, ghosted you. Let them be gone. They're gone for a reason. Pull yourself together, Scotty. Pinky's up, eh? Mmm. What else? What other notes did I make? No, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna leave that point because of the nature of the read. Uh -huh. Okay, let's get the uh, runes. Do we go to the runes? Let's protect our energies first. Energy's up. Mm -hmm. Right, let's move on to Hot Trot. Okay, the first rune I have. Ooh. This is an antenna. Downloads are being given and gotten. This is Algis, the elk. This is about you being protected. This is this is a sign that you would draw to ward off an evil eye. Yes, baby. Oh, evil eye bracelet. Peacock feathers. Mm -hmm. 
some of you, some of my Phoenicians have been spiritually tested of late. Feeling lackluster. Finding comfort in things that don't serve you. The smoke is all up in this shiz naive. Mm -hmm. Some of you guys are, are finding too much comfort in the smoking. Mm -hmm. This is represented by the letter Z. For Zemblanity. Yes, baby, that big pile of hopium. Yes. Mm -hmm. Xena. Zelda. Zenaya, Jeanne, Zion, Zachariah, Zach, Zachary, Zebediah, hey, Z, Z. Get another room, Scotty. Okay. The next room we have out is per Pertha. This is about mysteries. Mm -hmm. It's about your occult abilities, your third eye, your intuition. This is about you tapping into it, my Phoenician. Sometimes the only way that you can gain understanding is by going within and allowing the divine to send signs and guides along the way. But you have to be focused and paying attention. Trip trapping down memory lane to where the trolls are and the pillocks and the spiritually deficit simpletons ride on a spiritual short bus. It's not good. Mm -mm. This is represented by the letter P. Polly, Pollyanna, Pollyann, Peter, Paul. Get Peter up in this bitch. Mm -hmm. Sober and alert. Peter 5-8. Philip, Felicia. Patrick. Patrice, Patience, Preta, Price, Peters, Pandy. Who the hell is Pandy? Pandy? <laughs> oh. So we have Z and P. Mm. Oh, we also have radio in the reverse. This is about a loss of status. Somebody's car may have broken down, been stolen even. Mm -hmm. This is also about a, a cancelled journey, a trip. Mm -hmm. Mercury retrograde is in its full effect. This also speaks about somebody failing to evolve. Or failing to live up to what they said they was going to evolve into. Somebody not bringing the change. This is le represented by letter R. Rosalind, Raymond, Randy, Randall, Rondell. Rashid, Rebecca, Rachel, Reese, Ryan. This talks about a fall from grace, a loss of status. Mm -hmm. Roy, Rico, Ricky. Ricardo, Robert, Rahim, 
Mm-hmm. Remy. Okay. Drawing your attention again to Tarot and Astrology, your absolute wonderful book. No, they're not paying me to promote it. This is how fabulous I feel it is. Yes, baby. Mm-hmm. By Corinne Kenner. You can order it off of Amazon. I got it from my, my excursion to Glastonbury. For good karma's 11th birthday. Mm -hmm. Not my, our. Is that Joanna being called out? Somebody by the name of Joanna. You need to pay attention. Joe, Jay, you need to pay attention, Joanna. You're going to experience a full front status. Mm -hmm. Trick toffee or flip flop? Use my true love oracle cards to bring through the messages about the what ifs. Let's give it a good shot. These energies through these cards come through with the intel. The rainbow revival. This person sold you. Was it the original sunshine man? Yes. And I told you, shit shines in the sunlight. Yes, baby. This person knew how to build a dream. This person was able to get you to do things that you never did before. Could be with your pentacle and your edges. Yeah, losing all of everything. Mm -hmm. Right? This person was sent to take you off your life's purpose. They was meant to be a block in your life. And you believe in all sorts. Like, what, what sorts? Things like they can walk on the water. Um, like you could expect loyalty, love, honesty. Mm-hmm. This is a charlatan, a dick dealer, right? This person had no boundaries. Mm -hmm. They broke down your faith. This person came into your life with a lot of soul ties. This person was extremely insecure and lacked a true wisdom. This was a situation where the bridge you you was never you would have never been able to cross over to true happiness, true serenity with this person. I told you this was an agent. Mm -hmm. to bring a lack of faith and wisdom of self mm. good golly gosh that person was a true what blood clot yes baby mm -hmm. right i told you they came to break your serendipity your peace your happiness in some cases my phoenicians have got into that water uber and paddled away swiftly. Mm -hmm. You were divinely guided to leave that situation. Whether you left or they left, listen, don't matter. The lefation happened. Mm -hmm. Even though you left that situation, your path wasn't clear. You, you didn't see the whole road. You stepped out in faith, my solution. Some of you have been seeing shooting stars of late. Mm -hmm. And you will be noticing a lot of serendipity in your life. A series of fortunate events. This is about your growth. This is about you keeping your dignity in a situation. A situation that had you on your head. Mm -hmm. No boundaries. No divine guidance in this situation. Mm. 
this person question your spirituality any trying to try and, because as people age and have more experiences they they metamorphose yet they change mm -hmm. this person didn't want to see no change in your life it's all dull yellow a lot of dull, lot of jealousy a lot of listen that person was always in competition with you you was a, was a victim, victim of hate from the gate. Mm -hmm. Let's get my questions. Sorry about this, my Phoenicians. Mercury Red. I think it's falling from me. And there's me cussing in the background. I told you my trucks is going to kick in. Right? Got everything. Got it all. Mm. Okay. Look at the energy at the base of the deck. We have the death card. Mm-hmm. The death card is represented by Scorpio energy. Scorpio is ruled by Pluto as well as Mars. Mm -hmm. Okay, in the reverse, this person was, how can I put it? This person was a bully, right? They lacked courage. They were extremely insecure and aggressive with this insecurity. Mm -hmm. This. Pluto in the reverse, this person was definitely sent to block your, your destiny. Look! Three of Wands! Right? This person was sent to block your ship's calling kind of in. Right? Wands is about your will, your willpower, your drive, your passion, your energies. This person was sent to sap and take. Yes, baby. They were sent to what? Rob, kill, and steal. Mm, good God. Right? The Three of Wands steps up with um venus as well as aries energy mm -hmm. this person affected your stability your harmony this person was the original bad news bear even around celebrations they made it rain rain with what unhappiness full of zemblanity yes baby lord 10 of the 48 laws of power to be voided avoided at all times and if they approach you Let's go through the moves. Where is me? Oh. <laughs> I forgot. Karma Amor was with me yesterday and I moved my, my things around. Mm -hmm. They approach you. Free go-to moves. Muscle memory. Right? Take your chances with the judge. They come to your donia. They come to... Dis <laughs> I mixed it up, domium and cranium. Domium. If they should come to your domicile, open an upper window, straight to the cranium. They'll act like chicken licking and run away like Tinky Winky, La La, Dipsy and Bo. Back to Hades, where they need to be. Mm -hmm. With any luck. Look, you hear the Muppet music? Everything is a sign in my reading. Scotty, pinkies up as we push forward to get to the car. Mm. Bunch of Muppets, mate. They were being directed by Beelzebub himself. Mm. What attracted you to this karmic partner? Right? Three of Cups in the reverse. Good God. This person came in with a violin. Told you. That they'd come from an awful situation ship. Could have even told you that they was a third party in a situation. Mm -hmm. The Three of Cups is represented by Cancer as well as Mercury energy in the reverse. This person came with, di with a diabolical set of plans. Right? Mm -hmm. This is, I already said Cancer and Mercury energy. Yes, baby. This person came to, what attracted you is that you had lost your connection with spirit. You didn't fully understand yourself at that moment in time. 
you was dealing from a previous emotional drain. Mm -hmm. What else? What else? Because what was this previous emotional drain? Scotty, what was it? Oh, a lot of confusion. Right? As I say, a lot of confusion. Look, you see the Eight of Swords. You was mentally trapped in your head. Mm -hmm. How am I am interpreting the Eight of Swords today? Okay. You didn't know your worth. You didn't see your true self. Mm -hmm. You was trapped with the insecurities. Emotional drain could have been from, you could have been a people pleaser and met upon what? The person that needed to be pleased by everything you had. Yeah. <laughs> Let's clarify this eight of swords deeper. Yes, be of it. Heartbreak hotel. Mm -hmm. Two threes. This karmic partner, because all of these threes coming out so quickly, it was a third party situation. This person was in an emotional drain. This person had no intention of being faithful to you. Yes, be of it. None whatsoever. Three of swords is represented by. Oh, Libra energy as well as Saturn energy. Mm -hmm. And we all know Libra is about the partnership. Okay? This was not. Listen. That sunshine person, the gift wrap shit in Prady, Fender, Fendi or Louis. And more often than not, right? It was all put to Kelly. They put it together. Mm. Yes, be of it. This person could oh, let me let me formulate my words properly. This person caused a lot of conflict in your life. A lot of tears, a lot of heaviness. Always being mentally trapped in that situation, not knowing your worth. Sit in it. Sit it. Yes, you spread your buttocks out. On that chair, right? That plastic chair, right? That fake chair of other worth. Told you, victim of hate from the gate. Mm -hmm. Just need to have one deeper look. What else? Brought this person along. Yeah, I did. You was a, a studious. You was working on something lucrative or you had money. You had established, you was established, my Phoenician. Eight of Pentacle, Virgo energy as well as the sun. You was the sun. Yes, baby. They saw the shine of your pocketbook. Or billfold. Mm -hmm. This person put a lot of energy. Into getting you trapped mentally. This is with gaslighting, love bombing. Mm -hmm. This person made you feel that you was the answer to whatever situation they was coming from. Yes, baby, they put their back into it, Scotty. Mm -hmm. Right? Yes, baby. Look! Because they wanted to create a palace of F shit. Yes, baby. A lot of obstacles in that situation. Fire energy. So, yeah, fire energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. When this person came into your life, it showed a turn for the worst. For your pentacle, your luck, your situation. It was a big downturn. You was dragged back. Into nearly prehistoric times. Mm. Including with your words. You they nearly left you speaking like oh oh oh. oh. Yeah. And using what? Creative dance to express yourself. You had to shut up. Hey! You wasn't able to speak your truth in that situation. Mm-mm. A lot of 
this difficulty. But because they was the sunshine with the breadcrumbing, they're to block your life purpose, right? And to keep you boundaryless. Now, they wanted you as a thumber, right? They wanted you to be Lot's wife. Genesis 1926. They wanted you to be a pill of salt. Mm -hmm. That's what they wanted. That's why they was attracted to you. They was attracted to your work ethic. How the sun was able to shine on you. Your creative skills. Your mind. Mm -hmm. You was a practical, grounded person. They liked your loyalty. Mm -hmm. And then they broke it down so that you would remain loyal to them. Why? Because you was being loved bomb, dear. Mm. Because you didn't have a sense of self. You didn't. Because if you did, you'd have known this was a heartbreaker. Hairline taker. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, let's go to the next question. Mm. Give this a good shorty because this backup, this one, is giving us the what? The, the dub plate remix. Good golly gosh, 26 minutes in. And only one question. Mm. Okay. The next question that we are going to be asking ultimate goal from the manipulations and subterfuge and out to out blood clattery mm. as I sit my mocha my eyes are haughty and my lips are thin what's the ultimate goal right Listen, moon energy, on the queen of swords, they wanted you to be bitter. They wanted you to be bitter and scuppered. Mm -hmm. The moon is um, represented by Pisces energy as well as Cancer. And we have the queen of swords rushing through with um, water and air energy. This person was extremely emotionally unstable and vengeful. If it was a man, they should have been having menstruation, a period. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They always felt that they were better than you, above you. Mm -hmm. The moon and cancer energy, this is, this is about things being revealed. They revealed their shadow to your side, side to you many times. Extremely cutting. Mm -hmm. This person was a cheating cheatara, right? Got into all kinds of emotional, because the moon is about communication. They had emotional relationships with others. This is why you was always being compared and made to feel less than. Because they was getting intel from the chicken heads, no less. Mm -hmm. But why would they want you to be bitter? Why do they want you to be bitter? Right? Because they're bitter. Yeah, baby, they're my ball. <laughs> is going through sadness and loss and deep regret be a bee they feel like they're in a hole a hole full of enlightenment that's showing them what they did 
Mm-hmm. More for them. They dis and disrespect and try their utmost best to distort the prototype. Mm-mm. Can't work. Not in my parliament or the parliament of the Most High. Mm. Yeah, man, them full of regret. We need a different deck to look deeper into these cards. Mm. But with this Queen of Swords energy, you have become an individualist. You've learned emotional control. Mm -hmm. You're a quick thinker. Thinker, you are changing your perspective on that situation. You're realizing all of those things that they planted in your mind. Was diabolical nanotechnology. Yes, baby. That was eating, eating away at you. Mm -hmm. But you found justice. Because you've got a clear picture and you also have your two of cups. You are attracting what you need most in your life right now, my Phoenicians. Mm -hmm. And it ain't the palace of one's blood. Mm -hmm. With the jig dealer or the mattress bag. This person is involved with somebody who is dealing with them in the same manner. Hellfire, was it Hellfire and Powder House? Cheating, fighting, competition. Mm. Where's the Queen of Swords here? Right? It's because you're being get. Listen, this person wants you back, babe. Like five pounds that they need to make up a ten. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right? Coming through with Pluto energy. Good golly gosh. This person is watching your transformation and it is truly powerful, my Phoenician. Mm -hmm. Judgment is represent. I already said it's represented by Pluto energy, as well as water and fire energy. Your steps are being divinely guided, my Phoenician. This is why you are individual at this moment. I'm alone, single, right? Because you had to heal. There was a lot of starvation. Some of you had to get get medical treatment for what they did. Pisces energy as well as the sun energy. Mm -hmm. This also takes, talks about completion. You ended that situation. The situation is over. You know, I'll take them back. No. Mm -mm. That person is going through judgment. Karma has found their address. And is coming through with the appetizer. Mm-hmm. They're watching you take a great opportunity in life. Right? Gain stability and security, Capricorn, as well as the sun energy. Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. This is also saying that this person is extremely controlling that would love to come back into your life. And F it up. Right? With their age energy. Good God, I told you. Mm -hmm. On the moon. They'll be coming in with deception indicated, right? Something is going to be fishy. Yes, baby. Page of Cups is represented by water energy. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio again on the moon. A lot of cancer energy here. Mm -hmm. He's going to try and use a child or children to try and secure themselves. Get their foothold back into your life, Scotty. <laughs> Lord of mercy. Baby, darling, honey pie. Right? You get the yellow card. Because this is out of order. Followed swiftly by the red card. Baby, block it. This is a red flag. This is a solution. Health warning. Trust and believe. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This page.
page of cups is also telling me that listen queen of swords page of cups new perspective you're getting a new perspective on things dear everything has been illuminated by the moon mm -hmm. yes baby hidden ailments secret enemies secret enemies especially is being revealed to you at this moment in time somebody that's wanting to come and offer some kind of an apology don't listen do what you want do what thou wilt right i can't tell you what to do i'm i'm a, I'm a pointer not a picker right this person is going to try and rush back through mm -hmm. but divine is also telling you don't make hasty decisions because you must always remember law 21 of the 48 laws of power Play a soccer to catch a soccer. Mm -hmm. Right? Look what fell out in the reverse. The Ten of Swords. This person at this moment in time. Right? With this diabolical plan that they try to achieve. They are... They are in an unhappy situation. Right, feeling betrayed themselves. They're having a lot of problems with their children, or they're creating those problems. I told you. Mm -hmm. The children are pawns as far as they're concerned. Mm -hmm. oh! They are jelly bogelly. If they have a partner, that partner is watching you and hating you, and they've turned up the hate. Yes, be a bit. The Queen of Wands in reverse. This person is on a knife's edge. Trust and believe. Lots of disharmony. People abusing of each other. Wherever they be. There's a lot of abuse in that situation. Throwing them hands and them words. Some of them are having... Listen. They're going to have to get a big injection. Is that not the Muppets music again? Yes, we have been. It truly is. A clown show. A puppet show. They're in a relationship that is tit for tat and that is their judgment for their controlling, right? Shadow ways, their shadows, the shadow side that they, they put you through. Mm. What about this sadness and loss and guilt and unhappiness and crying? <laughs> and they might go through it, trust and believe. They might go to read. They may be putting on a facade, right? Because this is, we did see the Queen of Wands with the mask on, right? But behind that mask, <laughs> they might go to read. What about this Five of Cups? Feeling sad, are they upset? Yeah, they're sad because you're working on new things. Okay, you ain't even looking at them. You're looking at what you can produce and build. This could be you going back into study in order to add more pentacali to your pentacalis. Yup, yup, yup. Told you. They spying big time. And they're not even being paid for it. They're going into big time king spying. Yeah. This person goes to your page every day. Mm -hmm. And has a quick trot through. They're watching you gain intellect. But it's not gain intellect. You're being the true you. Mm -hmm. Seeing you get, you're gathering information in order to get your pentacles together. Mm -hmm. This could be about you putting together structure for a new foundation. Being you was the cornerstone that the builder refused. Why is that on my screen? Yeah. But the, that cornerstone that was refused is now the foundation for everything. And they know it. Mm. It didn't work. Because why the Queen of Swords is facing the shadow side? You went through that dark night of the soul. Mm. And you judged yourself for those foolish actions. You released. You made yourself humble and naked before Father God Most High. This is why you are being gifted with stability. 
This could also mean a new residence for some people. The buying and selling of a property at least. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, baby. Let's get you the next one. What was the lesson that my Phoenician was meant to take from this situation? This is what we want to know. Scotty, start. What was the lesson that you're abundant? Right, that nobody, right, can take it, take your Yui from you because it wasn't on you, it was in you, darling, dear. Mm -hmm. Seven of Pentecali is saying that whatever seed where you put your focus, it will grow. Mm -hmm. Seven of Pentecali is represented by um, Taurus as well as Saturn energy. Divine is telling you to review, you need to go back and re review your progress. And realize how far you've actually come, how much you've grown. It's all because of your persistence. This is why divine is rewarding you. Some of you are making new investments, stocks, shares. Mm -hmm. You're going to see abundance grow from that because you had the foresight to assess and invest in long-term goals. Mm -hmm. This is about you grounding yourself, understanding your true loyalty, understanding your loyal self. Also, you need to understand um, Proverbs 4.23, guarding your heart. Because whatever seed is in it will grow. And your heart is where your well of life springs from, my promotion. Mm -hmm. You ain't got no time for these, these pillocks. The dismal crew. Right? Love is Gemini energy. Mm -hmm. Gemini is about ruled by Mercury. This is communication. This is about you. Knowing that you are... The lesson you need to learn is where to put your investment. You may choose wisely. Mm. I'm also seeing Sagittarius energy here. You need to understand where you invest your energy in because you are going to attract true loyal soulmate soul family it may be a romantic it may be a platonic relationship but you are attracting what you need at this moment in time to continue to grow and expand mm. what else is there hmm We've got fours here. The four of ones. Pardon me, that was a belch. You know I'm speaking the truth, roof. Right? The four of ones is represented by um, Aries as well as Venus energy. Then we have the four of cups, which is moon energy as well as cancer energy. Then we have the sun, Leo energy. Yes, be a bit. Mm. This person is seeing you as a big, fat, missed opportunity. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But divine, they're allowing negative thoughts to block their blessings. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Terrific. Mm -hmm. they're, look, they're watching you create a more stable foundation with people, places and things coming in to help you, to aid you, reach your goals. Because the sun card is ultimate happiness. This is spiritual guidance. This could also mean that I'm a child. The help of a child turning round for the better. Being more stable. Somebody had a child going through some kind of illness. Where they felt powerless. But Divine is saying that you are not powerless. Your child is healing. And is healed. Mm -hmm. Right? 
Don't let them tempt you off your flip-flop, right? Because if they do, you will become brock pocketers again, just like them. I told you, them full of them vanity. Mm -hmm. Them have the bad juju and them them. I want to come share it with you, you. Yes, baby. Looking back over the years. Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. They looking back at that broken foundation. As you make wise choices, lucrative investments. Mm -hmm. The lesson that you need to learn. Is that whatever you choose in your life, it will grow. Mm -hmm. If you choose the wrong foundation, right? You'll be sorry. Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. The wrong foundation will bring you back into the pits of hell, right? With the, what? The dick dealer, the mattress back, the animal in a kitten heel. Mm -hmm. Right? Because you are that star. You've had a spiritual fire lit underneath you. Some of you are going on a public platform. This is why they are focused and seeing all what you're doing. They're watching you closer than any fan. They're just like Annie from Misery. Yes, you're your number one fan. Mm -hmm. Yes, baby. I feel like I need to bring another deck. Right? Because you've healed and you're healing. Your lesson also is to learn how to heal from this situation. Putting new boundaries, new beginnings. Yeah. Seven of seven of cups. Right? Divine is telling you to continue to choose wisely. Right next to choices. Scorpio energy. Make wiser choices. Look at what you're investing in. Investigate the situations. Mm -hmm. The lovers card. Right? Don't invest in F shit. Don't be drawn in by your Nefeth regions. Because you will be stuck and scuppered. By a manipulator. Mercury energy as well as air energy. Somebody that would use their mind on you. Mm -hmm. What about this stable foundation that you're pulling in? Is it this one? Yeah, because you turned your back on that toxicity. You realize that you have the world in your hands. You've brought balance, harmony and duality into your life. Right? In some cases, you're a high priestess. This is about you continuing to tap into your in, your intuition, going within to get your answers. Mm -hmm. The highest priestess sits between the two pillars of wisdom. This is look at this duality, two and two again. Mm -hmm. Sits between the two pillars of wisdom, Boaz and Jashin. From the Book of Kings, outside King Solomon's temples of wisdom. Yes, baby, you have the keys, you know their file, this pamphlet. You know that bloody leaflet that can't stand up on its own. The one that always had you up in third party situations, including against yourself. Mm -hmm. Right? Look! Oh! It's the high commander Decepticon, the narcissist. Yeah! Right? They're wishing. That they didn't use all of those nasty words, the one-up machine. I'm seeing Taurus and Venus energy, as well as Jupiter and Mars. Mm. This is all the planets saying. I'm also seeing Saturn. Uranus in the reverse. This person is on drugs, mate. Using a lot of elucidatory behavior. Listen, they're, they're playing a fiddle on someone else. Right? Divine to keep them blocked. Mm -hmm. Keep them where they're at. Right? Leave them in that mud hut with their upside down queen of wands. Right? This person is trying to get some information to you. They're going to, you got in, you have incoming. Right? Spiritual bath, Psalms 91, muscle memory, practice your three go to moves. Stevie Wonder, Easter Island. Stat. Right? Because they see that you've built this. 
Palace of Penticale, you are building a stable foundation, generational wealth. In some cases, my Phoenician, they see your potential. Even if you don't, continue. Mm. What about the sun? Why is the sun here? All right. When the sun shines, it shines forever. And justice is being sought. Mm -hmm. This is about balance. Things being, this is your season of, season, season of balance, my Phoenician. If this is a divorce, then papers are going to go through in the name of the Most High. And you're going to get what you want. Your children are going to be happy, right? Because they left them buck naked, right? Mm. They wanted your babies to be born with a skill. <laughs> and that's the truth, Ruth. I'm telling you, all rights will be wronged. I told you. Karma has them, baby. And this person is going to be reaching out, right? This person is feeling a lot of depression and a lot of disharmony in their life. And they want to come and share it with you. Mm -hmm. Got to press on, Spotty. Because time is of the essence. Final advice for my Phoenicians. Any final advice for my Phoenicians? This may have triggered some. Some of you need to be triggered so that you can't be tricked again and trapped. This is spiritual warfare. You need to know what line you stand behind. You can't be without boundaries, letting all and sundry up into your shiz naive. Believe in their lives and hearts. Look at the owl is up, upside down. Their lies you will get. Mm -hmm. Why, right next to a one in moon, you need to keep away from that person. Away! Right. I was going to ask final advice. Let's ask Kipa. Because Kipa keep it clean and tight. Final advice for my Phoenicians. Any final advice for my Phoenicians? Final advice for my Phoenicians. Yeah, Ben. Mm -hmm. Continue what you're doing and don't involve yourself with others that want to work against you, that will come and have you up in a third party situation, having you doing all the work while they're acting up with their familia. Mm -hmm. Right, what else has turned over? Right, look what they're saying. Right, deception indicated this person wasted your time and would like to come and waste some more of it. Yeah, this person likes a good floozy. What's a floozy? A harlot. A harlot. A prakala or a prakalisha. Mm -hmm. Yeah, baby, they're getting a message, all right. That whatever you're doing is going to be extremely lucrative. Mm -hmm. They're worried also that you're going to attract somebody of a higher status. Mm -hmm. That you're going to upgrade them. Well, well. Because you're having a new beginning. Continue to view life through the eyes of the child. Children view things with optimism, always. Mm. What else? Look, oh, chicken head. Oh, oh, child, look. The chicken head and his consort. Look, I told you, they're fighting where they are, okay? How many, how many bitches is in the back of this picture? Bring my tortoise of higher vision. There's two, right? Oh, there's three. 
Mm-hmm. Person's milkshake definitely brings all the chicken heads to the yard. Mm -hmm. This person is fake. They're dealing with a lot of fakery around them. This prakala, right, will try to come back with their fakery around you, but you need to be mature in this situation because you are that mature person. Yeah, right. Take them to court. Some people need to be litigated on. Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. Right. And end it. End the situation. Don't allow it back in bad health. This is a message. It's a Phoenician health warning from the Most High. Can't you see those authoritative thumbs before he seals the message? Get it. Because I'm telling you, it's better when the divine taps you on the shoulder rather than smacks you across the face. Hmm. Right. This is about a stable foundation. This is what you have coming towards you. Right. Something that is going to be something that is going to occupy your time. And from all of that work, you will be rewarded from those efforts. Why? Because you're not going to be dealing with community genitalia. Right. You've hopped on. The first thing is smoking. Mm. Final advice is to keep moving on. That person was fake, right? And they're going for it and they're seeing the abundance that you are creating and wants to come and leech off of you. The blood sucker, Prakala, Prakalisha. Mm -mm. Continue with the Matthew 10, 14. Mm -hmm. Remember Proverbs 26, 11. You are no fool and you do not eat vomit. Mm-mm. Not having that at all. Let me bring one of my Making Magic Oracle cards. Then I'm out of here. For sure. Mystic Storm. Harmony in the home and great friendships. I told you, you are attracting your true soul family at this moment in time, my Phoenicians. Whatever you did, Divine is telling you that you are doing it well and to continue. Mm -hmm. You're not going to... You're not even vibing on the same level anymore. That that will be able to take a stronghold in your life. Right? This is fairy magic. Repeat, repeatedly work with the fairies and elements, elementals to achieve your goals. Mm -hmm. This is also the sign of Choco Ray. Yes, baby. You need to put your stamp on it. This is about you going out into nature, grounding yourself. Okay? Feeding the animals around your domicile. I'm not talking about the rats. No, I'm talking about birds. There's always signs, my Phoenicians, but you need to pay attention. On that note, I dropped me mic. Have I covered everything? I do believe so. Oh, no, I didn't. Any more information on this karmic partner? Look what fell on the floor. As far as they're concerned, you must law five of the 48 laws of power. Guard your reputation because it's worth more than diamonds and gold. Mm. All right? This person, right, sees that you have no budget in life. Yes, baby. You are calling in them big pentacallis. They also know that you deserve love. Right? And that's where they want you, in isolation. So that they can feed you plagiarism of the mind, bull swank and use all the Jedi mind tricks. This side of the equator. Mm -hmm. What about my Phoenicians and their path? Their divinely guided path? Right? You are always going to have benefits. Because why? You are prototype, darling dear. Get with it. Know thyself, right? Justice is being delivered for you. You're not doing nothing for the gram. You are not. You are just doing you with your bad self. 
Yeah. So they better beat it, like Michael J said. Nobody of that vibration can approach you in the name of the Most High. So be it moat. Right? Look what fell on the floor. Divine wants you to continue to be an addict to your faith. Yes, baby. And on that note, I drops me mic. Thank you very much for your bookings and donation. Please hit that thumbs up, like, subscribe and share. Share these messages. It may not be for you. You may need to be the messenger in someone else's life today, my solution. Also, toddle over to Teesprings where I have a plethora of um, paraphernalia, including my prototype wear and range. Ho ho. That would simply titillate your fancy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Also, I'm offering a membership on this channel. Members get to choose the direction of the read on a Thursday. Why Thursday? It's Jupiter Thursday for truth, expansion, and the Phoenician way. Mm -hmm. And if you require a personal read from me, all of my information is in the description box below. And as I always say, from the ashes, baby, namaste.